The Ebola outbreak in West Africa from 2013 to 2016 was one of the largest, deadliest, and most complex public health emergencies of our lifetime. With more than 28,000 cases, including some 11,300 tragic deaths spanning Guinea, Liberia, Sierra Leone, and Mali, the disease had devastating effects within the region and for many thousands of persons. Our staff from IOM, the UN Migration Agency, were on the front lines of the response to the deadly outbreak, at times putting their own lives at risk. I want to thank every single IOM colleague who contributed towards the Ebola humanitarian response three years ago, from the nurses to the construction workers. With four countries gripped by a devastating health and humanitarian crisis, our staff bravely stared down harm's way to focus on doing everything possible to save the lives of those affected and to support the communities to which they belonged. First of all, from setting up Ebola treatment units in Liberia, establishing standard operating procedures at international airports in Sierra Leone, Guinea, Liberia, and Mali, rehabilitating key border points in Cote d'Ivoire, training countless volunteers and health professionals in Sierra Leone, your work truly made a difference. In such a time of great need and risk, IOM responded in full force, bringing specialists from around the world as well as local expertise to help those affected and to prevent further spreading of the disease. It took a truly remarkable amount of courage from the men and women to have worked during this time. And for that, I am incredibly and will always be grateful. IOM recognizes your tireless efforts and the deep commitments you demonstrated in responding to the crisis. All of us at IOM thank you and we are very proud of you.